With Alias 2021, we give you a wide range of new tools and improvements, which makes your design creation and technical surfacing workflow much easier. It all starts with a new splash screen, where you can select the different workflows. In SubD modeling, we added some more helpful tools and improvements, like the box mode for SubD only toggle to avoid box shading on NURB surfaces. The transform tool has new options, which are very helpful for concept modeling. The Extrude tool can now pick surface edges and curves of any degree and the new rebuild options help you to fit the SubD. A complete new tool is the Retop tool that lets you create SubDs over an existing reference geometry, so you can easily remodel over a 3D scan for example. The Align to Curve tool has more options and gives you more flexibility. We also have an area with Dynamo script examples, where you are able to build up quickly a wheel arch and many more. You cannot drag the import and export icon to your shelf in order to create shortcuts to often used locations. We implemented selection sets now, which makes working with reoccurring selections much easier. The new history visualizer shows you the flow of the history and you are able to replace inputs from there. In Skin and Draft, we added more options to the Crown tool. Surface Fillet has now a complete new fillet option called G2 Curvature Arc, where you can control the inner arc area and the lead-in area at the same time. The Reference Manager gives you the option to create assemblies and also support layer symmetry and visibility. For more detailed introduction, please see the specific What's New videos or the documentation. Thanks for watching the video.